Welcome to Log and to Learn Podcasts, North Lanarkshire Library's Learning Takeaway. This series of podcasts will help you to revise for Module 1 of your ECDL course, the European Computer Driving Licence. And don't forget, if at any time you want to know more, you can always visit our website at www.logintolearn.com. In the second podcast, we will provide you with information on the main parts of a computer. The components of a computer are the keyboard, which is used to type or input information. The monitor, or VDU, short for Visual Display Unit, is used to view information entered into the computer. A monitor's picture quality, or resolution, varies depending on the number of pixels, which are dots of light on the screen. The higher the resolution, the better the picture. Size of screen also affects the apparent quality of the picture, but price increases steeply with larger screen sizes. The mouse controls a movable cursor on the screen, allowing data input by selecting options. The computer is normally housed in a metal or plastic casing, sometimes called the system unit, and contains the following items. The electronics, such as the Central Processing Unit, or CPU, and all the other microchips. The hard disk drive, or HDD, is used to store programs and data. A floppy disk drive, if your computer has one, allows a user to insert a floppy disk, a 3.5 inch diskette, to transfer files to and from the computer. Note, many computers now no longer have floppy drives, as their limited storage capacity has been superseded by other devices. A CD-ROM drive reads information from a standard compact disc, or CD, which can contain application software, data or music. You may also come across other forms of storage device which can be attached to a PC, including external hard disk drives, zip drives, tapes, cartridges, DVD drives and flash drives. Most computers have speakers attached, usually externally, to play music or listen to communications. A modem can be attached externally or internally. This allows the user to connect to the telephone system and use email or the internet. Any piece of external equipment that is attached to a PC rather than built into it is termed a peripheral device. This covers external storage devices, printers, scanners, in fact, any device that enhances the capabilities of a PC system. Thank you for listening to our podcast on the main parts of a computer. For other podcasts to help you complete the European Computer Driving Licence and more information on our services, go to our website at www.logintolearn.com or call our free phone help number at 0800 953 1010.